Hello and welcome to the Interchurch Bible Quiz University of Ghana, brought to you by the National Bible Quiz Project and the Student Christian Council. The maiden edition of the Interchurch Bible Quiz started with 21 churches on the University of Ghana campus. After several fierce contests, nine churches have made it to the semi-finals. The first to make it to the semis was Ghana Methodist Student Union, Gamsu, who contested Fountain Gate Chapel and Life City Church. Gamsu, list the five major kinds of offerings that the Lord instructed the people of Israel to offer in Leviticus. So, the Lord instructed the people of Israel to give the sin offering, the peace offering, the grain offering, or meat offering, and then the, the burnt offering, and the guilt offering. That's correct for two points. Life City. List five types of animals that were used in the various offerings the Lord commanded in Leviticus. So I'll give two points. Fountain Gate. The mountain where Moses stood to view Canaan was the same mountain where he died. It's true. Although Gamsu led the contest ride from one, one, Life City staged an ambitious comeback in the fifth round, the riddles. The first video. We are an offering. We are a type of substitutionary offering. We were given as a gift. We are one of the tribes of Israel. We were in charge of all that concerned the tabernacle. Life City. Right. That's correct. <laughs> the next riddle. Peace. <laughs> the second riddle. I am a man mentioned in four Gospels. I am perceived to represent the fulfillment of an offering for one Azazel. In St. Luke's Gospel, I am revealed as a prisoner whose inmates come to. Useful. That's wrong. In, in typology, I am one of two animals that were chosen by the people for the people. Unlike the other who was killed for the people, I am the one who was left alone. Life city. That's correct. I am an area located outside the walls of Jerusalem on the southeastern side of the city. I was mentioned twice by Jesus for two different purposes, which both have great significance. I was known for one of the natural disasters which was trending during the earthly life of Jesus. I was also known for a water body which possibly had cleansing power or at least could be used to fulfill some of the rituals in the healing process. The meaning of my name is sent. Who am I? Life City. That's correct. By the third riddle, we are tied at 44 points. The next riddle. We are two double digit numbers concerning two individuals from the same family. We are mentioned together in the same verse of a particular chapter in the book of Exodus. The first is an even number and the second an odd number. The sum of the digits of the first number is 8 and the sum of the digits of the second number is 11. We are the respective ages of two important personalities comes from. 80 and 83. That's correct. After 
survive in the riddle scale. Gamsu won their contest with 47 points. Life City, who lost with 44 points, eventually made their way into the semis, being one of the three losing teams with high scores. The second contest was probably the hottest of the entire preliminary stage. Christ Apostolic Church, Casa, battled it out with Great Commission Church, GCCI, and Pentecost students, Spencer. Jezebel's husband, just like Herodias' husband, were both confronted by prophets concerning their sins. What are the names of the respective prophets who confronted them? Great Commission. Oh, okay. That's correct. The next question. Trace the genealogy of Abraham to real. All right, Spencer. Abraham, Isaac, to Jacob, to Judah, to Paris. It's wrong. Abraham, Terah, Nahor, Seru, then Ru, the last person. The next question. How different is the name Abraham from Abraham? Okay, great commission. Whereas Abraham means exalted father, Abraham means father of many nations. That's correct. The next question. Elim was the one Kasa. The place where there were twelve wells, twelve wells and seventy palm trees. That's correct. <laughs> the next question. Great Commission and Casa took turns to lead respective rounds, but at the end of the fifth round, we were both tied at forty-nine points, requiring a tie-breaking question. At the end of the contest. Pensa Legon accumulated 37 points. Great Commission accumulated 49 points. And Casa Legon also accumulated 49 points. There's a tie between Casa and Great Commission. We are going to take a question. It's a speed race kind of question. The land of Havila was known for three precious casa. Delion, Hood, okay. Onyx. That's correct. Casa won the tiebreaker to book the second semi final slot. The contest was likely too hot for Pensa, who ended with 37 points. But in the end, both Great Commission and Pensa also made their way into the semi-final, being part of the three losing teams with high scores. The next contest was equally exciting. Deeper Life Church, ICGC New Breed, and Presbyterian students Nubji locked horns. Which specific group of people did John the Baptist call Brood of Vipers? New Breed. Right. One day Jesus healed a blind man in Jericho. What was the name of this man? Blind Bartimaeus. Correct for three points. What is the meaning of the word Boanerges? Correct. What was the name of the father of Judas Iscariot? Simon. Correct for three points. What is the difference between Hannah, H A N N A H, a figure? Okay. Hannah was the Hannah was the mother of Samuel, H E N N A H, and A N N B was a prophetess that met Jesus at the baby Jesus at the temple. Correct for three points.
In Acts chapter 6, seven men were chosen to serve. Nicholas, Prochorus, Philip, Simon, Stephen, Nicanor. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you should have waited for me to finish the question. In Acts chapter 6, seven men were chosen to serve the tables. Mention any two criteria used in their selection. <laughs> yes, Nubi. Full of the Holy Spirit. Full of the Holy Spirit and wisdom, correct. Mention the name of one disciple of Jesus who was also the disciple of John the Baptist. Deeper life. And you. Correct for people. Pick the old one out and state your reason. Hagar, Keturah, Sarah, Rebecca. New breed. Keturah. Because she's the she's the second one. Wrong. New sheep ranks second. Yes. Rebecca, because mm -hmm. she was not part of either the wives or the mistresses of Israel. Correct. What happened when Jesus went to the land of Genesaret? Deeper life. When he got to the land of Christ and they saw he was coming, they called all their sick people and healed them all. Correct for three points. Why did Jesus forbid everyone from swearing by the head? Deeper life. Because you cannot make any of them right. <laughs> Correct for three points. What was the occupation? What was the occupation of Levi before Jesus called him? He was a tax collector. He was a tax collector. In the temptation of Jesus, the devil also quoted. No. In the temptation of Jesus, the devil also quoted a scripture. Which of the temptations did the devil attempt to use a scripture? Yes, Nubji. Selling stones into No. Yes. Deep alive. Okay. For it is written. If you cast yourself to the ground, the Lord will send angels to come and hold you up. Why did Herod put John in prison? Yes, Nubji. Um, because John spoke against Herod marrying the wife of his brother. Okay. You are right. After Zechariah's encounter with the angel, he went mute. At what point did he speak again? Deeper life. The name is the name is ceremony of John after John the Baptist after put the name on the tablet. Correct for people. Deeper life really showed their strength by suffocating their opponents, winning with 50 points at the end of the contest. In the fourth plenary contest, Global Evangelical qualified with 50 points. In the space of 20 seconds, Gesam, please quote three verses from Acts. Acts 1 verse 8. And when the Visa, hold, hold three verses from Numbers. <laughs> they were also the only team to get a perfect score in the round three, the test of the day, in the preliminary stage. The fifth preliminary contest was between Great Expectation Ministry, AGCM, and Winners Chapel Ghana. It was a very close contest till the last round where AGCM emerged winners and made their way into the semi-finals. AGCM, your major question holds in full three verses from Philippians. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6. 
do not be anxious in anything but in everything by prayer and petition with thanksgiving put your request before God. Philippians chapter 4 verse 7 and the peace of God that transcends all understanding will be given to your heart and mind. Philippians chapter 4 verse 8 Whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are noble, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue or if there be any praise, think on these things. We let's chapel Ghana, your major question, and quote in full three verses from Colossians. The final preliminary contest was between apostolic students, APOSA, Campus Christian Fellowship, CCF, and Legon Pentecostal Union. It was also close to the fifth round where CCF won and entered the semi-final. The next question, what is the parable of the rich fool? Yes, CCF. He was a man who was rich and after his harvest, he saw that he had abundance of things. So he said to himself that I'm going to tear down my old barn and build up a bigger one where I can store all my, la my, my, uh, my goods. And then I would say to myself, my soul, make merry. Then the Lord said to him that night, that you foolish man, this night I will take away your soul. That's correct for three points. Our nine semi-finalists are now set to battle for places in the final. Contest 1, Deep Alive vs. Spencer vs. Global Evangelical. Contest 2, AGCM vs. CCF vs. Life City. And Contest 3, Gamsu vs. Christ Apostolic vs. Great Commission. Who will make it to the final? Join us on Saturday, 8th July, at the Kofidra Conference Room, Political Science Department, University of Ghana, from 7 a.m., where these thrilling contests will be happening live. Join the discussion on social media with the hashtag NBQ2023, hashtag ICBQUG, hashtag TagYourChurch. <laughs>